Hi there. So, um, your reactions to the conference? I know you travel a lot. You've been many wonderful conferences across the world. Agile India, perhaps the first time. Um, so, your reactions to the conference? Oh, how has it been? It was great. Really enjoyed it. Lots of very interesting people to talk to. Tons of really impressive questions from people, and uh, just it was great. The best part of any conference is always conversations with people between sessions or maybe instead of sessions. And I have definitely not been disappointed in the quality of conversations, both with other speakers and with people doing real work here at the conference. It's been a lot of fun. So if you have to contrast or compare this with any of the conferences in the US or the Europe, <laughs> how, where would you, how would you rate this? Oh, that's not fair. <laughs> It certainly is way up there, that's for sure. Definitely top tier. Top tier. Awesome. Um, anything, if at all, we have to improve something coming around next year? Is there anything, one item, if things can improve? Nothing's jumping into my head. Venue, food. Oh, well. Um, Right. Okay, I am, I am not a fan of Indian food, but you're not going to change that. <laughs> <laughs> That's hard to change. Yeah, it's definitely yeah. hard to change. It was very nice to have a good Italian restaurant <laughs> that, that in the hotel. Perhaps we can look for that. <laughs> yeah, well, it was a good one right here in the hotel. All right. Um, in terms of people coming in, we know Indian, uh, most of the people here are attending IT services and a lot of the people whom you probably interact are in the product-based organizations. Mm -hmm. So how does, you know, in terms of questions, clarifications, how does, how does that? Actually, the fact is that most of the people that I was talking with, even here, and including everybody in my workshop, was in a product company as opposed to an IT services company. Um, there is an awful lot of opportunity for people in India to get involved in product, and not just product, like for Europe or for the US, but product for India because this is one of the most rapidly growing economies in the world. There's so many opportunities for getting involved in products to, for people here in India for products that sell here. I was just talking to a consultant who one week worked at a local company, small one that made products for the Indian market. And the people there just loved working there because they were making an impact on India. Um, no turnover. They were very proud to be part of that effort. The next week he worked at one of the big consultancies. Turnover 40-50% every six months. Um, pay was significantly better, but even significantly higher pay was not enough to make people proud and really like to work at this big consultancy because they didn't have the purpose of making a difference that mattered in India. So. As soon as they found another opportunity, they'd take it. Um, and I think there's a deep lesson there for the way um, work gets done in the country. Um, you have an opportunity, you have bright, intelligent people committed. If you can focus their passion on making a difference here in your own country, where there's so many opportunities to really make this is a better place to live, um, I think that you'll thrive dramatically. Um, the, eventually that will soak up all of the talent in the country and the U.S. and the West is going to have to figure out how to do their own work. <laughs> that's, that's an interesting... <laughs> um, the other thing I've been always pondering about is the fact that the skill levels and the, how the organization is structured in terms of in, in an IT services at least because that's been the maximum here. Uh, we don't necessarily cater to the skill upgradation as rapidly as the technologies are evolving. And Agile and Lean movement, as an example, you're still laggards as far as you know embracing the culture change and how we go about doing things. Any tips on you know, how- So I'm not sure I agree with you. Um, first of all, remember, we did, I didn't interact with a lot of IT services companies, but that's not what I saw. Um, I just m definitely saw people who were challenged, who who um, who said, "Hmm, I'm not just going to do project type stuff. 
I'm going to get involved in all of the very important technical stuff to make sure my code is good, um, great, and um, that's what I was used to doing in the past and I'm certainly going to do that in the future. There was uh, definitely a lot of people that were being challenged to um, and an awful lot of very skillful people, so I guess I just didn't notice what you said. <laughs> Wonderful. I didn't either. Um, but again, the groups that we interacted with um, were more typically either small consultants, um, products building for the Indian market, or um, divisions of companies based elsewhere, Germany or the U.S., that were creating products that were from India, not products that somebody else told them what to do. Or if the, somebody else was telling them what to do, they recognized the problem and were struggling to find a better relationship so that they they could be passionate about what they were doing. So I guess it's just a perception thing which is out there. Yeah, right. 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 No, I don't, I absolutely don't see India as lagging in the, the areas of Atom and Wing at all. Wonderful. That is really good. And, and by the way, um, sometimes if you say these things want a cultural change, maybe you should say um, our culture is good and we should figure out how to adapt those things to the way the culture works here. Absolutely. Absolutely. So, one last question. Would you recommend this amongst your peers wherever you travel to attend this conference? Absolutely. Definitely. Taking away from your one metric, which <laughs> so I'm just kidding. all right. And thank. You forgot the second part of the question, and that is why. And the why is because I think that it's possible to make a big difference. Right. So I actually assume that why because we have already been somewhere high up in the conference, so probably <laughs> it goes from there. Yeah. All right. Great. Thanks very much. Thanks a lot. Thanks very much. Thank yeah. Now I leave it. Up.